You can find the My Library tab at the top left of the screen when you log in. Think of My Library as your own personal library of models. Explore gives you access to the entirety of the BioDigital Human Library. From there, you can add models to be stored in My Library, allowing you to customize and publish the model. A model must first be added to My Library before it can be published. Once you have published a model, any changes made to the model within BioDigital will automatically apply to the published model. BioDigital models are saved to the cloud, which allows you to make changes to the model that will reflect immediately in your published content, no matter where it is embedded or linked, so there is no need to republish the model. Now, let's take a tour through my library. If you are not a member of a team, your library is private to you, so you will only see private models on the left. If you are a member of a team, you may already see models saved in my library by other team members. To the left, you will see private models and all team models. Private models will contain any models that you saved but chose not to share with the rest of your team. All team models will contain models that either you or other members of your team saved and chose to make available to the rest of the team. You may also see additional options underneath. These are collections. Collections are used to organize your models. Think of collections as similar to a folder on your desktop where you store files that are relevant to that folder's title. In the top right, you will see the total number of models in your collection or when searching, the total number of results, as well as the option to select all, sort, and change your view from tile to list. The select all option allows you to select all of the models in your collection or that match your search and export the list as a CSV. This is a great tool to use when you want to publish in bulk. The export will contain the title of the model, the URL, embed code, author, and thumbnail URL. Also, by using collections to keep your models organized and utilizing the CSV export, you can really increase you and your team's efficiency. Next to the Select All option, you can sort by most recent, title, and author. Lastly, you can select either list or tile view. If you switch to list view, you will see a smaller version of the thumbnail to the left, along with the type of model, such as animated or tour, the author name, and the date the model was saved. Use the checkbox to select the model to add to your export. The pencil icon will open the model in Human Studio, where you can make changes and customize the model. With the More Options icon, you can copy the URL to share with a colleague, or publish the model and share it with the world. Thank you for joining me. For additional tutorial articles and videos, as well as best practices, please visit support.biodigital.com.